You know, I thought uh, we give a lot of credit to Creighton. Um, I thought they gave us a great battle tonight. You know, battled back from a goal down and, and scored another one and made it a great competitive game for us. And, you know, it's a typical NCAA game. You never say die. But I think uh, what makes this team special is their resilience and their character. And they've been in these kind of moments time and time again. And they just will never give up. Uh, that's just the character of this group. And so, uh, you know, it doesn't matter where they're at. They're, they're going to bring it. And they certainly brought it the second half. And I thought created some outstanding goal scoring opportunities. We're probably unlucky to finish, to not finish more. Score three on them in the second half. Yeah, I mean, we outshot them 16 to five in the first half, three to one in corners. So we certainly felt a bit unlucky not to finish more goals, but um, they took some great chances. Uh, and, you know, what we didn't, you know, we talked about the soccer piece. We didn't change a lot. It's what we do all year. Um, but we really just challenged them to continue to believe and to fight, and that's exactly what they did. And I thought they doubled their effort the second half, which was amazing. Used to score. Yeah, I mean, I think it's uh, kind of like what we've asked a lot of our players. I mean, Molly's played a little bit out wide and centrally, and, and Bones played a little bit of everywhere for us um, and been dangerous. And the great thing is we asked them these last few weeks, we said, you got to take half chances from everywhere and every place and everything. And I'm so proud of how they embraced that, and that's what – Molly and, Bo and Bone have continued to do, and they've really gotten unlucky on some. And poor Sherry Ekstrom's hit more posts than anyone in Division <laughs> One soccer this year. But, you know, for them, I mean, Bone had some opportunity in the first half. You're like, are you kidding me? She's not going to finish. She just kept taking him and taking him. And Rouse kept getting in the box and trying to finish. So it just speaks to their character. Uh, but certainly they've sacrificed themselves for the team. And, and I honestly, I mean, I'm very proud. Of, they, they, they don't play for stats. I mean, they just play for the team and the win. And that's